Hello friends, welcome back to The Engine Fixer, where we make car care simple, fun, and stress-free. What if I told you that a bad sensor could secretly drain your bank account by guzzling gas like there's no tomorrow? Yeah, your wallet won't thank you for ignoring it. Today we are diving deep into the 10 most important sensors in your car. We'll cover what they do and the telltale symptoms you'll notice when they start to fail. Trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be a sensor expert. Let's get started. Number one, mass air flow, MAF, sensor. This little guy measures the amount of air entering your engine so your car's computer knows exactly how much fuel to mix in for the perfect, efficient combustion. Symptoms of a bad MAF sensor, rough idling or stalling, poor acceleration, decreased fuel efficiency, if your car feels sluggish or your gas mileage suddenly drops, this sensor might be the culprit. Number two, oxygen, O2, sensor. The oxygen sensor monitors the amount of oxygen in your exhaust. This critical feedback loop helps your car's computer constantly adjust the air fuel mixture to keep emissions low and performance high. Symptoms of a bad O2 sensor. Check engine light comes on. Poor fuel economy, rough engine performance, if your car starts guzzling gas like it's thirsty, this sensor might need a checkup. Number three, throttle position sensor, TPS. The TPS tells your car's computer how far the throttle is open, letting it know exactly how much power you're asking for. Symptoms of a bad TPS, jerky acceleration, uneven idling, sudden stalling. If your car feels like it's got a mind of its own, this sensor could be about to blow. Number four, Coolant Temperature Sensor This sensor keeps a watchful eye on your engine's temperature to prevent the disaster of overheating. Symptoms of a bad coolant temperature sensor Overheating engine Poor fuel economy Check engine light comes on. If your temperature gauge is acting weird, don't ignore it. Your engine could be at serious risk. Number 5. Crankshaft Position Sensor The crankshaft position sensor monitors the position and speed of the crankshaft which is absolutely crucial for precise engine timing. Symptoms of a bad crankshaft position sensor. Engine misfires or stalls. Difficulty starting the car. Poor acceleration. If your car is acting like it doesn't want to start, this sensor might be the issue. Number six, camshaft position sensor. This sensor works in tandem with the crankshaft sensor to ensure your engine's valves open and close at the exact right moment. Symptoms of a bad camshaft position sensor. Rough idling, loss of power. Check engine light comes on. If your car feels like it's struggling to breathe, this sensor could be the problem. Number seven, manifold absolute pressure, MAP sensor. The MAP sensor measures the pressure inside the intake manifold. This information helps the engine adjust the air fuel mixture for changing conditions like altitude. Symptoms of a bad MAP sensor. Poor fuel economy. Rough idling. Engine hesitation. If your car feels like it's gasping for air, this sensor might need attention. Number eight, knock sensor. The knock sensor is literally an electronic listener. It listens for abnormal vibrations or knocking in the engine, which can cause serious expensive damage if ignored. Symptoms of a bad knock sensor. Engine knocking or pinging sounds. Poor acceleration. Check engine light comes on. If your engine sounds like it's trying to start a drum solo, get this sensor checked immediately. Number nine, wheel speed sensor. This sensor monitors the speed of each individual wheel a crucial piece of data for advanced safety systems like anti-lock braking system, ABS, and traction control. Symptoms of a bad wheel speed sensor. ABS or traction control warning lights come on. Uneven braking, speedometer issues. If your car's braking feels off, this sensor might be the reason. Number 10, fuel pressure sensor. Last but not least, the fuel pressure sensor monitors the pressure in your fuel system to ensure your engine gets the precise amount of fuel it needs. Symptoms of a bad fuel pressure sensor. Difficulty starting the car, poor fuel economy, engine misfires. If your car's acting like it's on a fuel strike, this sensor could be the issue. And there you have it. The 10 most important sensors in your car and the symptoms you'll notice when they start to fail. 
These little devices might be small, but they play a huge role in keeping your car running smoothly, efficiently, and safely. If this video helped you understand your car better, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to The Engine Fixer for more tips and tricks like this. Thanks for watching, and remember, when it comes to car problems, you've got this. See you in the next video.